Welcome everyone to my channel that is fast and easy maths which is dedicated to give you tips and tricks related to mathematics. So students today I am going to solve number analogy sums okay. Lot of sums are available on the internet in lot of books okay. I have personally picked out these four because I have realized that more or less lot of uh, these sums have uh, two or three ways to get your answers okay so maximum of these sums have two or three ways and you need to pick the answer which is available in your options okay so let's begin with the first one here you have 4 is to 12 then 7 is to what so now please understand here you can directly understand that 4 into 3 gets you 12 so 7 into 3 should get you 21 but your answer over here or other options do not have 21. Now the tricky part is here you already have a none option. So lot of students would have marked none and moved on. But here just for a second I want all of you all to pause and see if you can get this 4 is to 12 there is some logic to this and see if that logic works over here and that option is available in your answer. Okay, so here I can say that 4 square minus 4 will get me what 12, right? 16 minus 4 gets me 12, correct? So now 7 square minus 7. So 49 minus 7 is 42 and that is my answer, okay? Now the next one, 8 is to 30. So now understand, now 30 and 8. 30 doesn't come in 8's table but I know that 8 into 3 gets me 24 plus 6 will get me 30. So similarly 27 into 3 plus 6. So that should be 51 plus 6 will get you um, 57 but unfortunately that is not one of me options. Okay. So now here let's say can I do this 8 into 4 minus 2. Right? 8 into 4 is 32 minus 2 gets me 30. So 27 into 4 that is what um, getting you 8108 yes right sorry 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 27 into 3 would be 81 plus 6 would get you 87 yet that is not a part of your answer okay so 27 into 4 is going to get you 108 and 108 minus 2 don't forget the minus 2 over here also we did it so my answer is 106 and that is a part of your options so students if you are liking the way I am explaining then please go ahead and hit the like button because that gives me tremendous amount of encouragement in doing these kind of videos. Also students don't forget to share these videos with whoever is preparing for these entrances or whoever finds a uh, quad section of all these entrance exams difficult because trust me this is going to help everyone a lot when it comes to entrance exams at least. Okay the next one is looks very difficult but it's one of the easiest of the lot okay so 315 is to 15 then 25 is to what so now over here this gets confusing and if you start with your five stable and all of that it will get super confusing so just look over here 3 into 1 into 5 gets you what 15 so 2 into 5 should get you what 10 and that is a part of your option correct now the last one the last one looks a bit tricky but uh, trust me it's very very easy okay so 1 is to 49 so 1 can I say 1 plus 6 gets me 7 and 7 square is getting you 49 okay so and if you look at your answers also that the options also had a tra um, had a hint all your options are squares okay so by default you would have a square or you will have to work with a square okay so now 3 plus how much 6 that is going to get you what 9 and 9 square is what 81. So that is your answer. If you want me to do more of these kind of questions, this is like for the first time I am trying number analogy. I am not sure how many of you would find it interesting or do you even find it difficult. Okay, if you want me to do more videos on these, please let me know. So in the comment section, I will definitely pick up more difficult ones and bring out the solution to all of you all. So that's it for now. I will see you in the next video.